hopefully for those that are are gonna make it, they will. If not, I will send this out to them. Okay, awesome. All right, so how's everybody doing? Um, any updates with your mentees um, that you can provide me with before we're finally uh, finalizing this end of the semester um, that maybe I can support you with during this time? I'm having my final meetings with all of them this week. Um, and then I will get the, the rubric and all that stuff uh, updated. <clears throat> Same as well, actually, Melissa, for me too. Yeah, I, I had my final meeting with uh, my mentee last week and we're, I'm waiting for her to contact an advisor after she takes her final exam and then to register for next semester. She is going to confirm, and then I'll let you know. I'll just make a quick statement that my students are pretty much done. Obviously, we're at the end, but um, one of them is still working through the workshops. But um, yeah, they should be all set. Anybody else? My, I met with uh, Wendy for the last time last week, and I think she's doing good. For final grades, I used to be able to just track that myself, but now you you send them out, right, Melissa? I do. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. And that's a good segue. So I know as final grades are being posted, I know sometimes we get um, a little delays depending on the instructors and when they're submitting their final grades. So if I don't provide them to you by um, the end of this week, um, don't be you know, worried about that, I will definitely send them as soon as all the grades are in, because then that way you can get the best, um, you know, notification there of like all of them, except just one at a time. So I'll kind of update everybody, but I did just send an email to all of y'all with your working mentees on just the updates of who has completed the workshops, who still needs to complete what, if they've registered for classes. So if you've noticed that any of those things have not been checked off, um, please go ahead and just remind your mentees that, you know, registration is definitely going to be, um, you know, a requirement before the end of the semester. So if they can meet with one of the advisors beforehand. And then um, with the dropped classes, I know that we've had some questions about that. So if you're like any of your mentees dropped classes, don't, as long as they've talked to you about it, please kind of rate them at your own, like how you feel would be best for them. Because I know that sometimes depending on what they're going through, I might not be aware of that. I just kind of send that as notification on my end from what I can see if they've dropped classes and if they've communicated that with you. Um, so if they have, please feel free to kind of deliver that on your own with your grading. But if you have questions about it, feel free to let me know. But I think those that already had questions had sent them out to me. So I think we should be okay for now. Um, and then I did want to make an update that on the team sides, we already did, um, I already created the, the final rating. So you can go into the team sites now into the, I just want to kind of double check that it's the right information that I'm providing you here, but it will be under the general tab under the mentoring program files and then important documents. And then you should see their 21 fall mentoring program rating for mentee. So if you have not checked that out, once again, we've laid it out the same format of like if, um, you know, you had two mentees, your name will be in those two uh, little bullet points, and then your mentees initials will be on there. Um, so don't forget to complete the full form. And then the rubric is still going to be in the same area. So under the same place that you find the assessment rating, but it's under mentoring program assessment. And that's that little yellow box that you should see that is out of 20 points. Um, and that's kind of just basing off of like, you know, what their rating is on their professionalism this past time um, around working with them. So if they've met that, please complete that yellow box as well, because um, that's another part of our unofficial ratings that we kind of give through I institutional uh, research office to give some ratings for us for the board and things like that. So that should be that. And then for any of the mentees that are still catching up on workshops, as of right now, I don't think that there's anything or any workshops that are happening on campus moving forward. So if they have not attended anything up to this point, they can still watch any of the recording workshops or the recorded workshops that we have through team sites. And that would 
be through upcoming events and attendance. So you, all the recorded workshops that I've had for this semester should already be up under recorded workshops. And um, if you click into that, once again, you'll see fall 21 recorded workshops that they can go into and complete for credit. They would just have to complete the survey link, which is in that same category under upcoming events and attendance. So, and my dog wants to make a special appearance. <laughs> <laughs> He's in the back. Um, but if you have any questions accessing that link or if it's not working out, let me know and I'll directly send it to you if anything. And what's the cutoff? What should we tell them the last day they could do that? I would really hope that they can get it done by this week. If not, I'm flexible until next week once we're like right before um, we head out for Christmas break. I wouldn't want them to do anything after classes, but if they really had some tough finals going on, I'm okay giving that flexibility. So any questions about that this far? Okay, perfect. Um, and then let me just double check. I don't have anything else. Sherry, am I missing anything that maybe I should review? I don't know if I've, no. I think everyone on here are old pros, right? Right. <laughs> so. Yes. Uh, the other thing that I just wanted to mention, if your mentee is graduating this semester, please notify me of that too. So then that way I can give them a nice little going away gift. Um, and then I'm also ensuring that they're getting that. I'm, I'm doing a checkup on myself of just like what students have started the program and when they're finishing, but just a nice reminder for me to know like what semester they're, they're ending at. And um, I usually like to give them like a little gift as they're parting going away. So if there is, you know, a student that's graduating this semester, please let me know. Um, but I think, oh, and the other thing too, I don't know if anybody in this group, but I did receive an email, um, that for those of you that may not continue for the spring. So if that's kind of, you know, something you're going through for the next, you know, semester or so, if you're not continuing with the program, please let me know. So then that way I can, if you're still working with a mentee that maybe is still going to continue, but you're unfortunately unable to, um, keep me in the loop about that. Um, so we can find somebody. But otherwise, I think everybody in this group is moving forward. I don't want to make any assumptions. So if not, please send me an email. <laughs> awesome. Well, if there's not any questions, I think that's basically all the updates I had. So um, by this Friday, if you can complete the rate, the mentee red ratings would be great. Um, so then that way I can kind of finalize some things. And like I said, I will also send an update once I get those uh, final grades. If you can't complete it by this Friday because of those final grades, feel free to just kind of hold off till next week if that's okay with y'all. Um, Cause I know, like I said, with final grades, it might be a little tricky happening this Friday. So I'm hoping by next week for sure, I can have everything done and send out those gift cards. Awesome. Well, if there's nothing else, then I will let you go early. I appreciate it. <laughs> All right, thank, thank you y'all. Thanks, Melissa. Thanks, Sherry. No problem. All right, bye-bye. Thanks guys.